Professor Darrell Evans is here to tell us about the bodily functions that we can't control. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> so don't go anywhere. See you after the break. Still to come. <laughs> this is like being in the ghost train or something, is it? Tom Chambers and Beverly Knight. Thank you. Welcome back. Now, in a moment, one lucky person will win a nodding Olga, but it's time now to explore our involuntary bodily functions. And here to guide us... No noise, Bert, you're losing your touch. And here to guide us through it all is anatomy expert himself, Professor Darrell Evans. <laughs> Darrell, lovely to meet you. <laughs> now, first of all, I know this isn't that... Even talking about it makes me do it. Why do we yawn? So we yawn because we probably think we're going to be bored or we might be tired or we yeah. think we might want extra air coming in. Yeah. It's actually all to do with your brain getting a bit hot. So as you can see there, what happens is your mouth opens, you take in a big deep breath <laughs> and you feel your ears click, yeah. usually, and then you start, yeah, as Verna's doing, wanting I then... I am start to talk yeah, about but it. You still want to then start to stretch, stretch out. It's probably something to do with the stretching um, 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 ability. And so contagious, very much. It Yawning is, is contagious. Reading about it, talking about it, people probably in the audience now just seeing that model um, and yawn, they're all yawning. They're not bored with the show, honestly. That's not happen, so. eh? You get chopped out in the cold, OK? <laughs> yeah, so it's all about cooling down the brain, probably. Do you have um, involuntary bodily functions? Oh, no, I'm prepared to discuss. No, I don't. Really? Oh, I don't know. Right. television, Paul. Oh, no, never told me about this one. Well, how about if you go out for, out for the night and you might hiccup afterwards, after having a few bevies or, yeah. a, or, a, or fizzy drinks yeah. and things like Maybe, that? Yeah. So, yeah, hiccuping. Yeah. It's all about a, a little thin sheet of muscle you've got called your diaphragm <laughs> that's underneath you. Um, so, just as we're doing there, look, hiccuping. What happens is that uh, the nerve that con controls it moves down very quickly and air rushes into your lungs and your vocal cords then snap shut and that causes the hick sound and when they open it's like the cough sound. So how are you supposed to stop hiccups then? So drinking a glass of water people say backwards I that can't might do help. That. Backwards. backwards. That's yeah, that's so like, yeah. like, yeah. like yeah. that sort of mechanism or breathing in and out of a bag. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. How would you drink a glass of water backwards? Oh no, he's making me do <laughs> So you're gonna do it like that. Oh please. Yeah. <laughs> Managed it though. Um, or a spoonful of sugar and vinegar. Not very nice, mm. though. How about giving somebody a flash? Is that a good idea? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's meant to work for some that's people. That's my favourite remedy. But can you imagine what the longest bout of hiccuping ever was? A couple of weeks. 68 years. <gasps> oh, my God. A guy called Charles Osborne in America. Oh, oh Yeah, God. miserable yeah. life. Miserable yeah, life. Right, that. You couldn't yeah. get rid of them? No, nope, couldn't get rid of them. Even with medication, didn't stop. Really? Yeah, <laughs> absolutely horrible. Now, Oates in charge next week, cos he's on the floor, aren't you, Oates? Yes, you, you're a bit yeah. worried, aren't you? You've got a funny good, feeling yeah, in your stomach. Yeah, I have, yeah. Oh, 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 look at all that. Yeah. So get that scene, too. So, yeah. butterflies in our tummy, that sort of fluttery feeling, perhaps before we come on stage or yeah. going to an interview or something like that, you're feeling a bit worried. It's all about the fight-or-flight mechanism that animals have. You either stand up for a situation or you'll run away from it. And what's happening is a little chemical is released by your body called adrenaline, and that opens up all your blood vessels, and it channels to all your muscles. So, in other words, you can fight or you can fly away. Um, but for us, what happens is it goes away from our tummies, goes away from our intestines, because it's not really needed there anymore. The blood goes into the muscles, and therefore you feel a bit of an empty feel. Same thing when you're a bit lovesick. So if you're a bit lovesick and you feel a bit empty inside and fluttery stomach, it's probably because you don't want to eat and things like that because there's no blood there to do its normal job. <laughs> this is like being in the ghost train or something, really, isn't yeah. it? In a really cheap fun fair, yeah. you know, <laughs> a really nasty travelling yeah, yeah. Didn't why? scare you much, did No, it, really? no, why no, do no, we scream? So you produce a lot of sound across your vocal cords, they wave up and down so you produce loud noises. Yeah. But it's probably because if we're in a situation that we're a bit frightened of, we try and scream out so that someone comes and rushes and helps us, or we try and frighten off the attacker. But if you're at Bolton Wanderers and you're trying to sort of cheer and shout and scream for something yeah. that's screaming. happened, a good goal has happened for your team, then you're screaming that way as well to show everyone that you're delighted by it. So it's all about that. Now, blushing. Um, listen, I've been round the block a few times, seriously, <laughs> and I didn't think I'd blush anymore, but I do sometimes. Yeah, apparently we've got a bit of a clip oh, to show don't. you. And I know who you're well. going to show, cos yeah. that rotten Enrique Iglesias... The other thing when you don't sleep, all those niggles and worries. What's yeah. a woody? But the... Uh, uh, woodies. <laughs> Not a woody. A wood... Oh, I thought you meant, like, a woody. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 oh! I can't. <laughs> I can't even measure the game. Yeah. Come on! <laughs> oh, my. Damn! I'm going to let you get locked. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I, mean, I, mean, I do, you know. <laughs> uh, well, he's showing you exactly what's happening. It's so dreadful. You've got lots of blood vessels in your face and in your neck, and what happens is the same thing with that fright, flight or fright um, mechanism. 
all the blood vessels open up, lots of blood rushes into your face, and so we look red. Well, my time of life. I mean, she can still be blushing. Yeah, you can't it's get rid of it. It's so embarrassing. Can't get rid of it. And the more you try and stop it, the worse it, it gets. Absolutely, yeah. yeah, so it's a bit contagious there. But you don't blush when you're on your own. I'm glad to be crack up at laughter. If I see Joyce doing it, it'd pay off. I'm on the floor. Well, we've got another VT clip of you doing that as well. Oh, no. Yeah, Why yeah, that's absolutely. Yeah. Oh, I'm no, going to be blushing here. Got everything. One, then. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> It's also it's also contagious, and that's oh, why they put shocking. a can trap laughter on, on, on situation comedies and things like that because it's contagious. But does that make you laugh? No, not at all. I find that's that quite scary. I find it, and me, I find that terrifying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> so it's Has back. somebody slipped something in my tea today? <laughs> <laughs> so so what, ha what happens, basically, you've got a little happy centre in your mind. Yeah. And what's basically happening is your mouth Brilliant. opens, you start to go, ha, 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 and then, but halfway through the laugh, you have to then breathe in, so you go, <gasps> because you can't take it. And your muscles all start hurting. Stitch. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. Hello, you're using your muscles. Though, like that. You know when you're on the floor? Yeah, stress relief. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes you feel fabulous. much, much better afterwards. You go in the absolutely. kitchen and you think, oh, I yeah, feel better. Yeah, enjoy that. that. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> well, thanks for all that. No Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, please, Professor Dowell. For more details, go to our website. <laughs> All right, then. Nodding, no, what are they? Nodding olders we're doing. Oh, how's your butterflies? There you go. Take your Oh, 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 Elizabeth Ann Langley from North Yorkshire. Cheers, thank you very much. Well, that's it for tonight. A big thank you to my guests, to Vernon Kay, to Fiona Bruce, to Zoe Lyons, Yay! and to Professor Darrell Evans. Joining me tomorrow, we've got Tom <laughs> Chambers really and Beverly Knight. That's all live at five on four. See you then. Ta da! It is the...